Hello everybody, welcome back to Seven Days to Die. We are in a brand new playthrough, and I don't know how long this playthrough is going to last, but it will be a not a definitive playthrough. There is like an end goal that I am going to be going to that I will explain in just a minute, but we have got several other things to cover as well. I'm just going to try and stick to the point. We all know how well that works, but uh, first off, the settings. We're going to call our save Dishong. We are sitting on survivalist difficulty. I've got a max of 45 zombies, and the reason being is because most of the zombies are going to be in the area that I'm in anyway, so I don't need, you know, like 5,000 zombies because we're not going to be traveling all that much. You'll find out why in a minute. And then we have got the daytime speed is run. I have got the block damage at 200 because I do that on every single playthrough. I'm just an impatient person. I drop nothing on death, which I have done forever, and I have got airdrops disabled. Now, the reason why I have the airdrops disabled is because we are actually doing the Dishong Challenge, but it's a modified Dishong Challenge. Namely, I've got mods and I've got different rules, and anybody is allowed to follow along with me and try this on your own and see how it goes. Um, there's probably a few people who would probably make this a little bit more difficult. I don't typically start on Survivalist. I usually upgrade to Survivalist. So I'm actually starting on a harder difficulty than I'm used to starting on, plus I've got a mod that's going to make it even harder Actually, a couple of mods that are going to make it even harder than that. So we're going to try and make it harder, but different. We have actually got it to where uh, when we die and we come back, we have a harsher death penalty. If I have a broken leg or I haven't eaten or if I've got an infection or something, I come back with that plus half health. So that is, it's going to be dangerous. And I've got the dangerous cities going, so it's even more dangerous. And the entire map is wasteland, so that is even more dangerous. Basically starting out with all of the badness. I do have a couple of things to change some stuff and things up to make this playthrough as possible as it can be while also being difficult. So I've got it to where I could find eggs inside containers and I can use the sinks to get more water. And um, I've got the for the farming reverted back to Alpha 19. Not that I will be able to get a whole lot of stuff for the farms, because the main thing is, is once I go into Dishong, I'm not allowed to touch the ground again. And by that mean, I can touch the ground floor inside of a building, but I cannot go out and walk the streets. But that also means that if by chance I can build a bridge later on to another building, then I can go into that building so long as I don't exit out of that building. And if that building leads to another building, I can go to that building. But I'm hoping that it will be enjoyable. The end goal, the ultimate goal, is going to be the same goal it usually is for the Dishong Challenge, and that is to get up to the roof, create a uh, gyro, and fly off. Now, whether that's by finding the books and getting all the stuff to make the gyro, breaking things down to get the iron so I can smelt it into steel, and then, um, you know, so on, or having to take the perk to be able to get it. So... I'm not necessarily geared towards the ultimate playthrough. I'm geared towards being able to create a vehicle and get out. Speaking of which, Dishong has to be my base. At the end of all of this, it has to be my base. Even though I could possibly move to other buildings, I always have to come back to Dishong. I can't just, like, move around the entire city, and I have to be able to get to other buildings without building supports to get to those buildings, which means in order to build over to another building, I have to be able to build off of Dishong and straight into the building. I can't go all the way down to the ground, place a block, and then build over. I can't do that. Uh, is there anything else that I wanted to cover as far as the rules go? We're going to be in Dishong. We can't touch the ground outside after we get into Dishong. Um, I'm starting out. I have already done my beginning missions and then parked myself outside of Dishong, which is where we're going to start. I have got on dangerous cities. We have got harsher death penalties. I have got the ability to use sinks and, well, working sinks and coolers. I think I have to craft them, but I'm not sure. Um, so I've got those abilities, but it's going to be very, very hard because I can't leave the building. And once I can leave the building, I can't touch the ground, which means I have to be able to build over to the buildings that are in the city, and I can't leave out of those buildings and go onto the ground either. The ultimate goal being to get the gyro up on the roof and fly out. And that is how I can leave. This is the Dishong Challenge, but it is modified. I've seen people doing the Dishong Challenge in, I think the first time I saw it was Alpha 18. Uh, we are trying it kind of different because a few things have changed since that Alpha. First off, let's... Uh, first off, <laughs> let me get in here before I do anything else. 
There we go. Uh, the reason I'm doing that is because I want to make sure that I'm not getting attracted out there. There's a lot of danger out there, and I prefer not to have to deal with that out there. Um, I have already done my beginning missions, which means I laid down my bedroll. It's right there. I've got uh, all of my stuff. I've got 10 arrows, and I dropped everything extra. None of the other stuff is in there. Also, I want to take this opportunity to tell you guys, first off, thank you so much for the support on this channel. This is a brand new year, and I hope to be doing a lot of changes, but I will bring those up in another video. But for now, I would like to go ahead and tell you guys I have a new camera and a new microphone. So if there are any visual glitches, like if the, the camera stutters or anything else like that, or just completely freezes, I do apologize. Or if the audio sounds a bit weird, I do apologize. I will be watching back each episode in between to try and make tiny adjustments as I go, because I have found that if I make a huge adjustment, I usually break things. So it's better to do small adjustments. So please be patient and stick with me. If there's like a weird auditory thing, let me know if it shows up in the video, if I can't hear it for some reason. Um, also, if there's any visual issues that you guys catch that me or editing Liz do not catch, I would definitely appreciate it. Um, but right now, we have got to attempt to try and clear this floor and the next floor before the evening time. And I say that because I want off of this floor because we have the Dangerous Cities mod. And right now, uh, that means that there's lots and lots of bad guys out there, you know? Uh, I have got... Is the lockable thing working? Yeah, it's working. It looks like it is anyway. Uh, we do have these things right here, but I don't think that they would grow anything later on because there's not enough sunlight. But who knows, if I leave these things alone and they don't get destroyed during a horde or something, I might be able to knock the roof out and use these growing things to plant stuff, assuming I find any seeds. Uh, now, <coughs> day one. In the uh, wasteland, I probably have got ferals, so I need to be very, very careful not to attract too many guys at one time. Where, oh where, are bad guys? Uh, as soon as I get in the light, it's going to get a whole lot louder. Can I? I heard that. I heard the thunk. Like, that was the indicator saying a zombie is here. That wasn't me. That was somebody else. Oh, no. A balloon boy just walked in the front door. Uh, that's not good. Do I have, like, a full-on horde coming in? Because I see people around the front as well. I haven't even cleared this area. Could we just not do that, please? Okay. Oh, there are two of you back here. All right. Dang it. Uh, did somebody hear me? Right now, his butt is in the way of me shooting the other person. I don't trust the uh, collision right now. I need to wait for him to disappear. I have got to be very, very careful. Death is not an easy escape. I've got a mod going that I, if I die, I come back with half health and all of the status ailments that I had before I died. Nice. Uh, Karen has come in the front door. Can I please have drink? No. Okay, now how does the, the sink thing work? I don't know. I'm sitting here just watching them through here. I think I have to craft it, but I'm pretty sure I'm gonna have to have like a a warp batch or something to craft it. Oh, I hear badness. I hear badness. Okay, now, um, I'm not going to be able to get a whole lot of clay unless I happen to be able to bridge over to a building that's got the ability to get clay. 
So I probably should pick up the plants so I can scrap them down. Uh, and sadly, I don't have a whole lot of wood. I'm going to have to break some things down so I can try and block the door off just to keep wanderers from coming in. Because right now that's basically what I've got is a whole bunch of wandering folks just walking in the front door. <gasps> oh, you do not need to come over here, dude. Oh, man. You're just going to sit there and walk at that for a long time, huh? Okay, I guess I'll go this way. And he's back over here. I probably should have started out the game with like 10 frames or something like that, just so I could block up the front door. But I think I might be able to break some stuff down over here without alerting them. And then be able to put some blocks in in front of the door. Or if there were some loose chairs, I could do it with the loose chairs too. But I don't know. I think I could probably find some chairs upstairs. That might actually be a good idea. Hang on. I'll save these guys right here for uh, later on because I'm going to need the leather anyway. I'm going to have to make like bellows and things like that in order to make a forge. Well, I have to, you know, I can make a forge, but well, after I take the perk points, I'll be able to do that. I haven't even assigned my perk points. There's window between us. Could you come back out here, please? And, and don't, don't slap the books. There is just like the ever slightest possibility I could make this challenge really, really quick and find all of the schematics and stuff and things for the gyro. That was a horrible shot. Daggummit, dude. I don't have that many arrows. Here, I'll, I'll get him. Be very, very quiet, thick. There we go. Okay, he's walking around. Balloon boy is back in there. Daggummit. Where is he going, though? I would really like to get the books before, you know, too many stupid things happen. What is she over there planking for? What happened? Are they basically aggroing each other because, like, th this doesn't make any sense? Maybe with all of them over there, I could go over to the other side and maybe find some things that I could start blocking the door in with. Uh, there's a door behind, I mean, not a door, but a chair behind this desk, I think. And if I could just discourage them from coming in... Uh, it could make things a little bit easier. Okay. There we go. That's one. Please tell me there are some more... Ch okay, there's another balloon boy. Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh. No, 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 no. That hurt like a lot. Oh boy, did I bring everybody over here? I may have brought everybody over here. Out of stamina? Okay. And just run them around in circles. Oh boy. This is this was a bad idea. Okay, 
Full stamina. No, 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 no. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Nope, 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 nope. How on earth am I... <gasps> There's a bear! Huh. Yeah, not, not gonna happen. That's not helpful. How the hell am I supposed to fight a bear? Uh, I've got four of those. I've got a knife. I guess that helps. Um. Huh. <laughs> this is a silly- this is exactly the reason why I wanted to block the door in. Um, I actually need to get away from these guys and lose them so they'll wander back outside, hopefully. Uh, if I could, hold on. I don't think I can jump that far. a good place to hide. Oh no, here he comes. Nope. 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 This is a bad idea. Well, guys, I might be screwed already. I did not get the doors blocked up fast enough to stop something like this from happening. I need other things to block the doors. I think... There's an office over there. Nope. Nope. Oh, please don't let the bear be on the top floor. <laughs> oh, good lord. There's a whole nother group coming in. Okay, 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 this is stupid. I have to stem the tide of zombies though. No! Oh god! Game over. Ah! Target neutralized. He one shot me! Well, maybe not completely a one shot. Not completely. I forgot, I have to bring my bedroll inside. Oh no, how am I supposed to get inside? This is this is cheating, guys. You are cheating. Let me in. Thank you. Okay, I've actually got full health, but I've got like half food and water. That seems broken. No! Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. No! Stop! Stop! I'm dying again. I'm dying again! I'm dying again! <laughs> Twice. Nice. Okay, I was worried that this challenge was not going to be challenging enough. What have I learned? It's challenging. Okay, I did that, but I can't even run right now. I need my bedroll inside, otherwise I'm gonna feel like every time I die and I spawn back out here, I'm cheating. Can I make another bedroll though? Yeah, I can. Okay, if I can just, if I can just find a spot to put it where it's semi-safe, I'll be happy with that. Okay, back inside. <clears throat> yep, that's, I'm gonna wind up breaking it. Oh no. Good lord. <gasps> Whew. Okay, I made it. Okay. I 
I really don't know how I'm supposed to do anything about this. Aside from hope that they eventually lose track of me, which I doubt very seriously. What if I... Can I, um... Oh, you're at 10,000. I, I need, um... No. I need stones. I don't know how I'm supposed to kill those guys. Everybody seems to be mo moving off. Okay, how many chairs are still over there? It looks like they've broken a few of them. The issue is, is it, if I can get off this bottom floor, I'll, I'll be far enough away from the normal bad guys. Plus, I need to stop the wanderers from coming in, so I need to be able to block that in. Now I'm kind of curious if I can. I, I do need to wait until my leg heals because if I don't do that whenever I come back, it's just going to be broken again. Dying will not fix it. What I could try and do is as soon as my leg heals, run to the bathroom and try and smack on one of the sinks or the toilets or whatever to get some stones. And then I can... Uh... Maybe that. Yeah. Uh, and then maybe I can... Um wait until they no longer see me and then I can start tossing them back outside and hopefully get all the zombies to go outside. <sighs> Thankfully it's so dark here that they can't see me. I'm okay with this. So, <laughs> since I'm sitting here and not really doing much of anything and I can't really do anything until after the zombies kind of chillax and start wandering back outside, the cop sees me. 39 seconds, come on. Did he go in there? Nope, 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 nope. I don't want to get caught in here. Woo! Woo! Uh-uh-uh. Oh, my stamina's gonna be gone before I get to it. Okay. The bear knows where I'm at. Uh Okay, it seems like all the bad guys went up went up there. Okay, that's that's something. That's something. Um I'm not sure exactly what that is. Other than interesting ish. Uh Nope. Oh my god, I got hit by a fly-by bear. Oh my gosh. Savage, dude. Every time I die and come back, this is just gonna get harder and harder and harder because I'm gonna keep coming back with less and less health. And less and less food, apparently. The goal is to try and grab... Oh my gosh, why now? Why now? Don't do that now! That was bad timing. Bad timing. Okay. Nope. Come on over here. Holy hell, this is a bad idea. Okay, and there that should stop most of the zombies from spawning. Well, not spawning, but just wandering into the building. Why am I stuck? Why am I stuck? Why was I stuck? <laughs> what is going on? <laughs> no, 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 no. Stamina was gone. Stamina is gone. Okay. Woo! All right. Let's just do a loop. Keep it to walking. Uh, stop. Ow. Ow. Never mind. I have to run. He's gonna kill me. He's gonna kill me. No, Jason Voorhees, don't do it. Don't do it. Uh, I have never had such a hard start before. Oh my God. <laughs> what have I done? I'm gonna try really, really hard to be stealthy about this. It's not gonna work. 
Come on. Nope. Oh, no stamina. Oh my gosh. And the bear was already in there. Oh, Lord. I'm so glad I didn't do permadeath. Yeah, three lives was not enough. I, I feel like I needed to start this a completely different way than my original thought process. Oh, now my arm is broke, too. For two hours. And I have 25 health. What happens if you come back with uh, so little health you just die every single time? There are so many bad guys, but they're all over there. Hey, I got a sewing kit. That's something. Please don't let there be a zombie in here. There's a zombie in here. I would prefer you not alarm everybody in here that I'm here. These guys hit like a truck, dude. <sighs> Damn bear. <laughs> it's eventually going to get better. I mean, I've only died like 15 times in the first day. Hang on. Uh, six times in the first day. And everything of mine is broken. But, you know, it, it it's definitely going to get better. There you go. Take the bear with you. Go, 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 leave. <sighs> okay, I've got three seconds left. Where is that bear at? I mean, I've obviously got zombies wandering around and everything, but that bear is like the biggest problem. Having to run for men is getting me killed every single time. Uh, if he doesn't sideswipe me, basically I haul tail trying to get away from him. I run out of stamina and then get caught by a whole bunch of other peoples. So... That's not a whole lot of health. Let me see if I can go place this back down again. No, why would you do that? Keep walking, dude. Keep walking. Oh man. <laughs> Thick. Don't, don't, don't do it, dude. Don't do it. You don't see me. Keep walking. <laughs> oh, thank you, dude. Thank you. Oh boy, that bear is coming back down again. Okay. Where did he go? Not helpful. Keep walking. Don't start nothing. There won't be nothing. Okay. <gasps> no! Do not let me get stuck in here. No! Oh, one hit. One hit. Oh, no, 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 no! I checked one item! I am one hit from death, basically. I'm the one touch person. One touch from a zombie. Well, now it's probably one touch. Before it was two touches. Great. Now they're all piled up in the bathroom. Yep, they're all in the bathroom again. Oh, 
or trying to get in the bathroom. Good lord. Okay. Knowing that they're all over there, can I go somewhere else? No, because there's a bear there! Why is my stamina so bad? <laughs> Please swing! <laughs> oh <my God. laughs> oh, she was close to being dead. Now they're all gonna be up there. Now the issue is, is they're gonna sit in there and break all of those. I can't let them do that. Okay, I'm gonna have to ask all of you to get out of that building. Okay, kill me if you have to. Oh my god, I really didn't actually want to die, but... <sighs> if they sit in there and just break all of those containers, there's no chance for me to get my leg fixed. But there could be meds in there! I need to check! I need to check it! I have to check it. it. Could you move away from the bag, please? I have to check. <gasps> Run! <laughs> that was stupid. But I had to. No, the bear is in there! Nope. Oh my god, he's right on my butt. Uh, uh, uh. Where am I at? Oh no. Oh, stamina. Oh, health. Oh my gosh. Here, let's just walk around this way until I get shot in the back by one of the guys. Oh no. I have never died so much on day one. What was I thinking? This actually sounded semi-easy. This is this is not easy. Now they're all over there. Does she actually just die? Uh They are still breaking the chairs that I have in the way. I think the only way I'm gonna be able to do this is if I get off of this floor for a while to allow the bad guys to go away. Uh, it looks like the bear went outside. I I don't know if this is going to work, but I'm going to try and make it around to the stairs and beat open my way onto the staircase. Okay, hang on. Okay, that's a little bit of damage. Of course, if I get hit again, I'm going to die. Please do not let that bear be outside again. No bear. Oh, he stopped. Come on! No! Okay, I should not have waited. Oh, there's the bear! Okay! Are you done breaking all of the meds? Of all of the places for you to find yourself in, you decide to go in there and break all of the meds. I, I do appreciate that. Oh, here he comes. Um... Can I get off of this floor? Oh boy. I, I don't know about this floor either, but at least I'm off of that floor. Okay, that's something. Uh, there's gonna be bad guys in here and I really don't have the health. Uh, can I... I can't make another bedroll. I really should have brought another bedroll with me. I would like to be able to put it up on this floor. Okay, I, I don't mind clearing this floor this way. You guys have already gotten close enough to break this. If I can get some of you guys cleared from that floor, I'll be all right. Uh, 
I need some duct tape so I can make a splint. There, let me use this. There you go. My stamina is so gone. My character is so hungry and thirsty right now. Can I please catch somebody on fire? I killed somebody. That's that's a start. Please do not come in here. No! Ow! Ah! Oh, I cannot believe I made that jump. Meds? Pipe bomb! Sure. Where's that bear? That was a waste. <sighs> I have two health! No! Dang it. I just jumped straight into the mouth of the bear. That's exactly what I just did. Oh my gosh! Uh, I don't have a way of blo blocking this off either. Uh oh. Here he comes. Jeez. No, no, no! Here comes all of them! I can't see. <laughs> Dang on it! Am I ever going to get to the point where I'm not constantly dying? I mean, I was, but I was cowering on an upper level. Here they all come again. Yep, I kind of want that bag. I need to see if there's anything important in it. Never mind, apparently I'm not getting that bag. Uh, this is not safe. Okay, that's not safe either. Alright. This is the kitchen area. The last thing I need to do is bring all of the bad guys in here so they can wreck all of this stuff too. So how do I stop this from happening? Uh, there's nowhere to go. And I'm out of stamina to go there anyway. Oh my gosh! <gasps> Whoa! Oh my gosh. No, 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 no. Not an abrasion too? Daggum you! Oh, there's the bear. I found. I found the bear. He he was he was on the second floor, guys. He was he was on the second floor. Where's the exit ramp? Oh, okay, that's where you guys are. No, 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 no! I can't go out here. Oh my god! Okay, just go ahead and kill me. I'm hearing her giggle, but I don't- Are you kidding? You cannot just airdrop a bear on top of me inside of a building! These are not okay things! Hey, 360 no-scope me, man. <laughs> no. No! Lady! No, lady! Good grief. No! Oh my god, there's so many in here! Stop the things! Ah, uh, stairs? Yes? Ooh! Okay. <sighs> uh, no? Are you kidding? I finally found a safe spot and you had to come in here? Oh! I have actually got somebody in here right now that it's affecting my FPS. Yeah, all of you go in there. All of you, go in there. 
Yeah, that's the perfect spot for you, right there. If I just had an explosive, but I hadn't accidentally used up bad. You know? If I don't get off of this floor, I'm gonna be in so much trouble. What are you guys doing? Oh, there's the bear. Can I? Hold on. I can't hit you. Dang on it! Uh, hang on. I might be able to make some more frames. Holy hell, it sounds like they're right outside of this room. Nope, it does not sound like they're right outside this room. They are right outside this room. Can I please get on the ladders that I set up? Come I am tired of taking it easy. I want loot and I need drinks and I need food. Ow. I guess I did walk into that. Oh my gosh. Now I. Hmm. Nope, 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 nope. Dang gummit, don't get stuck in the menus. Why? Out of stamina. Out of stamina. Perpetually out of stamina. Oh boy, the bear's over there now. Um. Oh, I am so dead. Alright, ladies and gentlemen, that is it for this playthrough. As in, I am fixing to revamp the playthrough and make it a little bit easier because I'm not having a good time doing this. This time I'm going to go back in there after I take that mod out and we're going to try and make progress and see whether or not that's actually the problem. It probably is seeing how it's making it to where every time I spawn in I've got injuries that I can't overcome. So let me get back inside my appointed building. Ouch. You know, I could I would love it if I could see. Hang on. No, seriously, you just decided now is the time to do like this little hiccup of a jump? I don't appreciate that. Nope, Ed. Ow. There's a bear. I just saw him. No, get- oh my gosh! That's not what I Okay. I guess that will work. Holy hell. Okay, 15 health. That's that's awesome. But you know, that's that's fine. That's it's a good start, I guess. I don't want to make it too easy on myself, you know. 15 health is more than plenty. Oh no, I did not mean to come in here. Let's get- okay. Look at that whole crew of badness. They're just wrecking the whole bottom, basically three floors. Which means all of the loot containers are in danger. That- okay, there's a whole headbanging line going on over here. No, 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 no. Okay, what are you doing? Oof. Good lord. Karen, where the hell did you come from? Woo! It's random zombies! Run! Okay. Who's gonna get the shot? I was not expecting you behind me, Frank! Oh, 
Oh, okay. They're walking on each other. Holy hell! Oh, okay. Ow. Somebody is behind me and very, very upset. It's her. Stop the things. <gasps> Karen just three 360 no scope my booty from the top top rope. Yeah. I did manage to run around and get several hits on people. I don't think I killed anybody, but I did get several hits. Look at this BS! What are you guys doing? If I had an explosive, you guys would be toast. And there's the bear. Ow! Ow, 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 ow. Oh, he dodged. He dodged. Ah! Back around this way. Yeah, it'd be really, really nice if I could... They just keep coming off the top rope. They've gotten tired of my shenanigans and are actually falling on me from the roof. These are really, really good strats. I was not expecting you guys to pick up. <sighs> okay, I'm gonna have to ask all of you guys to come down here. You're getting on my nerves the whole flying in thing. Hey, what are you doing? Stop that! Stop pushing! No, no, no! You're gonna reset the health on the beer. It's hard enough to kill that damn thing. Are you serious, dude? Oh no, oh no, I don't want them flying down from the top rope and hit me in the face. Bear! Oh my gosh! Who let a bear into Dishong? Me. There you go. Hey, come back here! No, 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 come back! Oh, man. Can I just kill the bear? Stop, lady. They're trying so hard to get me to come off of here. Stop. But thanks. Oh, she's on my ladder. Get off my ladder. Oh my gosh. Yep, this is gonna turn out bad. Again. Um There's got to be some place I can go where this is not a big deal. Don't really want you guys inside the kitchens. Um. <sighs> that. It's frustrating, guys. I don't know what to tell you other than that's frustrating. That's like two floors of loot I'm losing because they're down there wrecking it. And I need those floors worth of loot. No! No, stamina, stamina, come on! You would just swing! I'm sorry, you wouldn't just not swing, you would swing very lightly. Probably ineffectually, but enough to stun it long enough to- Oh my gosh. I hate this. I hate it. Whose idea was this? They're fired. 
I'm back on the bottom floor again. There. Oh man, they're, they're positively wasting everything on the lower levels. There we go. Now then, you guys stay down there. All of that loot that I have missed out on because of them. Okay, now craft me a bedroll. Nice. Progress. I mean, it's not a whole lot of progress. It's not a lot at all, but it's progress nonetheless. Holy hell. Okay. I kind of want to clear some of this floor, but at the same time, I want all of the guys that have been chasing me this whole time to mosey back down to the lower levels, preferably. I can't see. I'm stuck behind a door. Ow! Why didn't I give myself a helmet light mod for this? What the hell? Where did you come from? Okay, you want to explain to me why I've got five frames? I think it's the 5,000 bad guys that are outside, really. Nope. Okay, that got one of them. Now, can I walk you around this little thing right here? can't just keep respawning you guys. <laughs> Take him. Nope. Use it. Fuck's sake. I can't even see. Okay, I finally killed you? With seven health left. Yeah. Sounds about right. You know what, I probably should just park myself over here in the corner so I can try and get rid of some of the bad guys. Maybe they'll wander off or something. I have no idea. Guys, I'm gonna go ahead and call this episode here. I have a feeling what I'm gonna have to do is go back and just restart this entire series with some different mods and different specs or something like that and work my way up to this. I might have started off a bit too tough for my skill set. Anyway, I will see you guys in the next episode. You have a wonderful day, wonderful night, and you stay shiny.